It was the summer of 2018. I was seeking new experiences. I thought I had everything figured out. Graduate, get my degree, a career in marine biology. However, it wasn't soon after that when I was hit with the harsh reality of my dreams. I thought the sea was going to claim me that day. I sat underwater, tank secured. Water entered my nose, my mouth, and the panic set in. Trembling in fear, the claustrophobia became unbearable, and before I knew it, everything went black. What was next for me? If I couldn't dive, who was I? I collided with the surface. My breath was heavy, heart pulsing, tears flowed, suffocating. But then it hit me. This wasn't a tragic event or an excuse to give up my aspirations. This was an opportunity. This is the first time I truly felt the redeeming qualities of the ocean. Every individual connects with water in a different way. Some people dive with heavy equipment. Some people swim in open water competitions. Some people dance in the rain. Some people have never even seen the ocean and yet still have a connection to the water around them. The sacred bond a person has with water is a bond that nobody can break. It's a spiritual relationship unlike any other. And it's this deep emotional attachment that I have with the ocean that saved me. I leaped, trusting myself, trusting my lungs, trusting that as I swam, she would keep me safe. I started snorkeling, I started free diving. The sea has given me a second chance and I'm not going to waste it.